after a little change up from golf today, uh, I'm going to take you on a little behind the scenes of a client shoot today. First, just need a little coffee to wake myself up after this last weekend. The problem that first day is that it's not the most exciting kind of job to take behind the scenes, although I do love doing these kind of things. So for my client video, it's a two camera setup and it's uh, just filming two kisses, which is essentially two interviews basically, where I sit clients on a chair, prop up the cameras on the tripods, press record and away you go. But they have asked for a few behind the scenes shots. So I'm gonna try a little bit, something a little bit different. And while they're running through it, I'm just gonna kind of scope around the room, get a couple of extra shots of them from the sides. And uh, yeah, and obviously take you behind the scenes through this camera. So let's see how it goes. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Genius, old age genius. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Exemplary. We couldn't ask to be part of this. Every single pound, every single penny that we give or help raise goes straight to those families, goes straight into the community. And that's really important for us to know that everything that we're doing is going out there to people who need it. What made this case really kind of special or a bit more special is that it was about Vindico's chosen charity, which is a Mega My Foundation, and it was started by a guy called Richard, who unfortunately, really sadly, lost his daughter um, to leukemia, and he started up a charity to help other parents going through that um, situation in life, support them, provide support for their kids. Whatever, and I think it's a really great charity. Why did you start the Mega My Foundation? Uh, well, it, it, it all, you know, the sad story that my daughter was in hospital for, you know, for four years, and of course, a lot went on after the passing of my daughter. When I first heard about it, obviously, any decent person would feel horrible, but when you become a parent, um, it just gets you even more, I think. Well, I know I don't even want to think about what it's been through, what it's still going through, and I just to know kind of what he's done, how he set that up and recovered from it all is just absolutely amazing. And, and um, also we were doing um, a merchandise line that my daughter really wanted to do before she passed away, and this is my daughter's artwork, and uh, that's going to be on there now going forward, so they can come and support that by repping, and all the money from that goes to the foundation. And any events they see, just try and come to them and just support us. And uh, together we'll be stronger for doing that. It's kind of wrapped at the end of this vlog. I'm off to meet my wife and my daughter right now for lunch. And just made you appreciate that a little bit more. I hope you enjoyed it and uh, see you in the next one.